When he attacked the medieval Catholic view of the Mass, Martin Luther said that the Lord's Supper was a gift and not a work. Uh, it's a gift that God gives to us that we receive by faith. It's not a work that we do in order to somehow gain God's merit, uh, gain merit or gain God's favor. Uh, and he believed that the Roman Catholic Church had turned that upside down. Instead of treating the Lord's Supper as the Father's gift of His Son to us through the Spirit, uh, the Church had turned it into a, a work that the priests perform in order to tap into the treasury of merit uh, that the, the saints had stored up over the centuries. Uh, Luther's emphasis on the Lord's Supper as a gift is important and crucial for understanding what the Lord's Supper is in Scripture and in the, in the life of the Church. But it is one-sided, and we should recognize that there is a, a, there is a point to be said in, in favor of the medieval view, not that we receive merit or win merit in any way by the Lord's Supper, but it is an offering of ourselves and our work as well as God's gift to us. It's always important to remember that the uh, products of the, the, the elements of the Lord's Supper, the bread and the wine, are cultural products. They are things that are uh, produced by human labor. Uh, the bread of the Lord's Supper is like the tribute offering in the Old Covenant system. The wine of the Lord's Supper is like the uh, the libation offerings of the Old Covenant system. Uh, these are not merely things that we receive from God, but they're also things that we bring to God as a product of our labor. And this again gives us a clue to the significance of our work. God places us in the world into, in order to transform the world and offer it back to Him. But what we learn in the Lord's Supper is that when we do that, when we uh, follow through on the logic of the tribute offering, we offer things back to God in worship, and He gives those to us as means of communion with Him. And so that, that means of worship in the tribute becomes a, also a means of communion with God. And there's this reciprocity and there's this mutual giving and receiving. The Lord's Supper is a gift to us. But in the context of that gift, we give ourselves to the Lord. He gives himself back to us. He gives our work back to us so that we can commune with him in and with it.